Hey everyone, Guardian E here with a summon video in Seven Deadly Sins Grand Cross. So I do have an account in this game. I don't really play it that much. You can probably tell by the stamina that I have that uh, I really just kind of log in. I downloaded the game initially just because I like the character designs and visually it was just very stunning. And then I just kind of stuck to biding my time, logging in every day, doing kind of the bare minimum until something came along that really, uh, really excited me um, and doing daily summons and everything like that. So... As you can see here, we have a collaboration with King of Fighters 98 featuring Kyo. We've got Mai, always a fan favorite and one of my favorites, certainly. Uh, we've got Rugal as well as Athena. And then Galther is also, for some reason, rated up on this banner. But so that's the collaboration. And um, as you can see, there is a mileage uh, up there at the top. So if you spend 600 of the diamonds, you will be guaranteed one of them um, just by reaching that, that threshold and that limit. Uh, we were given summon tickets throughout the course just by logging in. I've just been using them every day. I didn't save them up because I wasn't sure if it was worth doing that preliminarily for the video. And of course, doing those summons actually add to your mileage bar. As you can see, we're 78 quote unquote crystals or diamonds in. And uh, I will just show you that on the last ticket that I spent, I ended up getting, I ended up getting Rugal, Omega Rugal here. Who, uh, who is awesome. I think Rugal's a badass. I've always liked his character design a ton. Uh, Genocide Cutter and all. And I think that uh, I think he's actually supposed to be really, pretty darn powerful in this game too. So we actually lucked out and got him. Now that being said, our target today is going to be Mai. Mai Shidanui. So one of my favorite characters. We're absolutely going to go in for her. And we'll go to the 600 crystals if we need to, to pity for her. Uh, there's actually this other banner right now, uh, Lions Festival Eve, A Wonderful Past, where there's this character, Camilla, who I think is in, I think she's an original character for the game. Uh, I think she looks awesome. So I think if we don't end up burning everything for uh, for Mai here, I might spend some for Camilla. I think we get a whole bunch of these uh, draw tickets for free just by logging in every day. So honestly, I don't know how many Seven Deadly Sins videos were gonna be putting out so I, I just because I'm probably gonna be summoning for her too I'll just kind of combine them all into one big video um, after we do our summons for King of Fighters I'll keep doing my dailies uh, or logging in every day to get the summon tickets for a wonderful past and then we'll splurge and try to get Camilla as well so we'll, it'll kind of be a two-for-one here um, and hopefully if we're lucky uh, we'll actually luck out on both so let's yeah let's just get started let's do a uh, an 11 pull here on the collaboration. This is actually the first time I'm spending diamonds, really, um, in the game. And uh, here's hoping there's some luck with us on our side. Now, the rates are pretty bad for the collaboration units, I'm pretty sure. Um, not too great overall. Okay, we're getting beat up pretty bad here, so I don't think we're going to be getting anything. I don't have a semblance of the animations themselves and what they mean. A lot of them, I think, are pretty random, probably. But we have the blue text here. He's got a stick, and we got beat up. So that means we're probably going to get a dead multi. Probably going to get blown away here. I suspect that's what's going to happen. And yeah, it's not like we're going to get a sun in the sky. If, if we got a sun in the sky, then Escanor would show up and save our ass. But clearly, that is not the case. So... Um, this one's going to be dead, and I don't anticipate any of them actually transitioning and turning into a rainbow uh, summon at all. Um, okay, there's Elizabeth. Always like seeing Elizabeth and Hawk. I don't remember which color that one is. Uh, and like I said, I don't... <laughs> I really don't know anything about the game. Ooh, another Hawk and Elizabeth. Nice. I do like how there's like a ton of different skins that you can you can get for each of the characters just by summoning them. And there's like a different color variation of basically every character. The thing is like Seven Deadly Sins as a franchise doesn't have that many characters in it. So there's a ton of alts and ton of different colors of the same character. And then, you know, even beyond that, um, there's a ton of original characters created for the game because again, I think uh, despite the universe being pretty cool, I, don't, I just don't think it's that expansive. There's just not that many of them out there. So, uh, <clears throat> So yeah, like I said, this one looks pretty dead. In fact, I think I'm just going to skip the rest of this. Yeah, and then our 11 pull is a rare as well. These turn into tokens that we can exchange for characters in the future. So let's go into the next the next 11 draw and hope we get a little bit more exciting of an animation this time. 
All right, so gold skip bar or gold skip text. We have a stick. We're getting beaten up. Um, I suspect this is going to be absolutely nothing. Uh, there was a little little flash there with the explosion. I don't know if that was just it's blue text again. If we lose this, I'm just gonna skip. And yeah, we're losing this. Let's skip. Yeah, that's <laughs> that's pretty bad. Actually, let's let's check the rate real quick. Just because I didn't do that, I usually try to do that in these videos just so we have a semblance of what our odds are. But if we take a look at the rates, as you can see, each of the characters has a 0.35% rate up. The overall SSR rate is 3%. So yeah, not terribly good odds. Um, and in fact, actually, okay, no, it is it is rated up compared to the other SSRs, but still, still not great, right? So let's go into the next multi. Uh, what we want to see, I think, is uh, we want to see. Um, oh, there's a uh, there's Hawk next to us. Usually that means we get a, um, a Meliodas as a character, I think. So we're fighting back. We have the Mark, and it doesn't necessarily mean anything. We have the Broken Sword. And it's blue text. I don't think this is going to really do anything. If we lose this, I'm going to skip. We tie. Okay, it's gold. I don't think any of these are going to transition. I'm going to... I'm pretty comfortable with skipping this. Yeah. We didn't really get much here, unfortunately. That's all right. Let's draw again. Again, the rates are pretty bad, but it's a collaboration, so I don't anticipate having a lot of opportunities to get these characters again in the near future, so... what the hey. Uh... Alright, we're, we're fighting back. We haven't countered yet. Countering, I think, guarantees us a, an SSR, if I'm not mistaken. But I don't know that for certain. We've got the gold text. What, what do we got? What do we got? And we're gonna lose. So I'm gonna skip this. Yeah, that's pretty terrible. Oh boy. Yeah, I mean, as I understand it, the rates are, are pretty rough. Pretty rough in this game. Um, it's just they do have some pretty nice mileage, usually. It's not bad. Okay, we get the red eye flash. That could be good. See what I mean by, like, these ornate animations being random? And, like, hey, look, we're getting beaten up, too. So what does that mean? I, I have a feeling this is going to be nothing. Uh, it's gold text. I'm not going to bank on any of the golds turning into rainbow, so if we get the gold here... Yeah, I'm just going to skip. Just going to skip. Oh, we got a new character. Who's this guy? You see him? Okay, Dreyfus. Alrighty, that's fine, I guess. Alright. Draw again. Um, I do have... Oh, red skip text. No eye flash. Broken sword. Got the mark. Still haven't countered... We're getting beaten up again. I'm gonna skip. We're getting beaten up. Yeah, alright. Oh, man. Alright, so we are close to the first mileage, which is a guaranteed SSR. Is that... No, I think in two multis we're, we have a guaranteed SSR. Which is not a guaranteed collaboration SSR, it's just a guaranteed SSR. Alright, same deal. We're gonna fight back at least. No, well, we're, we're fighting back, just no counter. These, uh, these pulls so far are kind of as expected. We do have a uh, blue text and a non-broken sword, but I'm not optimistic here. Yep, we're getting beaten up. Let's skip this. Yeah, not good. Not good at all. At least we're guaranteed an SSR on the next one. If it's my... Uh, we can count our blessings and duck out. That, that would be something else, wouldn't it? I'm not going to count on that, given how our luck has been lately. Uh, we have the tree branch. We have the mark. It's daylight outside. And we're getting beaten up. I, I think we get the free SSR. Maybe we don't get it in the multi. We just get it afterwards. That's very possible. Okay, gold text. I guess we can go through the multi just to see since we've been skipping all of these, since they've all been garbage. Okay, we're getting beaten. <laughs> we lost the battle. It, it can't be a good thing. And we only got two golds. Now, getting um, 
getting SRs is... It's not bad because you can get tokens and exchange them. So getting dupes, there there is a dupe system. If you get enough of them, you can exchange them in the shop. So it's, it's not terrible. But... Ugh, all of these... Very uninteresting characters. Oh my god. Skip. No. No. <laughs> Marmus, okay. Alright, Hauser. Alright, Marmus again. Oh, uh, Simon. And... Oh, man. Yeah, that's... That's not good. That's not good. We're certainly getting a lot of these medals. Alright, so let's check the reward for the SSR. I don't think we get to select one. And we're going to get Galther. Okay. Uh, he is the rated up one, right? So he's new for me. That's nice, at least. A new SSR. I just want to get, like, one counter. Can we get one non-guaranteed SSR here? At a 3% rate, you would expect to get three of them per 100 pulls. So... Uh, we're definitely... Well, I guess we got that... We got that Rugal. So, I guess I kind of... You know, put things in our favor a little bit in terms of the rate, because we did... Did end up getting one on our on a guaranteed pull. Or not a guaranteed pull, on a, on a free pull. Uh, I am gonna... Anything worthwhile, Vivian, Marmus, oh my god, Ruin, oh yes, ooh, hello, Jillian, yeah, but certainly not new, alright, let, let's skip this, yeah, okay, uh, currently going as expected, <laughs> we're probably gonna have to go to the pity to get that Mai, but that is okay, I am all right with it. Let's um, we get another animation. We got Hawk there. Can we finally counter? No, we're not gonna counter. All these really ornate animations. That's the thing. Like, I don't mind having ornate animations. I think animations are, are you know, can be cool. Uh, what I don't really like is random animations because I feel like, uh, to an extent, like I like having. I like having it be a guess as to whether or not you'll... I, I don't like having it reveal that you have a dead multi very early. I think that that's like a, a buzzkill, generally speaking. So I like always there being a chance of it being like a fake out into something good. That's that's usually, I think, a, a positive. However, what I will say is if you have like a million different variations of animations and half of them don't really seem to mean anything and you just have people guessing and speculating about what they are, I'm never, I've never been a big fan about that. I, I just think it's a waste of time. <laughs> I think it's a waste of time. I think transparency is better as far as that's concerned personally. But, uh, you know, it's fine. Uh, we're getting the red skip text. We have Hawk sitting next to us. We have a full sword. We have the marking on our face. Can we actually... <laughs> we're getting beaten up. All right. Yeah, we're getting our ass kicked. Are we going to lose this? We at least get some kind of gold text. So usually if you get rainbow text there, that does mean that you're going to get an SSR, more or less, and we're going to lose this. So I'm just going to skip. I'm going to stop wasting my time. That is annoying. Yeah, so we are... So 600 crystals would be... Uh, roughly 200 summons, about, thereabouts. Uh, a little bit more than that, because you get 11, 11 in a multi. There we go, we're getting the counter. Okay. So, that's our first counter of today. I think that guarantees us an SSR, if I'm not mistaken. I've, wa I've watched a number of... Yeah, there we go, Rainbow Text 2. That's a good sign. That's a good sign. We're gonna tie here, so I don't know what that means. But, yeah, we're getting... We've got the Rainbow Text and everything, so we are getting at least one. Uh, I don't know where that is. Oh, it's the very first one. Are you kidding me? I just, I just got him for free. So is this like a Halloween outfit? Oh god. Okay. Well, that's fine. Uh, dupes are useful in this game, generally speaking. If you want to power up a character, I'm going to skip. I'm not going to assume we're getting anything else, and we didn't. All right. 
Oh boy. That's uh it's not a good look. This is not a good look. Got the tree branch, the marking on the face. If we don't counter, I'm gonna skip. And I'm gonna skip, because uh yeah. Just getting a bunch of tokens. Just getting a bunch of tokens. So, so far we've gotten one SSR other than the guaranteed SSR. Uh, we got the red skip text. We got Hawk next to us. We got a bunch of sh stuff in the sky. Did you see all those, like, shooting stars and stuff? I don't know if that's good. Um, all right, we're fighting back, but we didn't counter. So, I'm... Um, see what I mean? Like, I have no idea what that means. What, what do the shooting stars mean versus... Uh, okay, rainbow text. So, that does mean we're getting a, an SSR here, which... Is, uh, is great. We're going to tie. Uh, so we haven't won. I think if you win the battle, maybe that means that you're going to get a, a focus uh, or a banner unit. I'm not entirely sure. All right, we're, um, I think it's the next one in the in this, in this batch. No? Alright, Meliodas. Is it this one? I never know in the circle where it starts. So I don't know what... <laughs> which one in the circle the... Uh, the rainbow is. I'm just gonna have to go through these one at a time, I guess. Yeah, seems that way. There's Jude. Okay. Marmus. And uh, I think I already mentioned this, but yeah, if you do get a gold crystal, it can it can actually transition into a rainbow. I don't know how with what frequency that can happen. But generally speaking, you'd have to have like some pretty ornate animation ahead of time, probably, to clue you in that, that that's going to happen. If you have a pretty dead animation... Okay, here's the rainbow. And... Oh my god, it's Rugal! <laughs> well, we did get one of the banner units. Um, it's a dupe, because I got him off of a, off of a ticket. But, uh, I mean, a dupe is useful, actually. So we get... Don't we get special um, collaboration coins for this, so can't I trade him in? I might be able to trade him in, I'm not sure. Actually, I should have checked before I kept pulling like this. But I'm pretty sure I can trade him in for maybe one of the other collaboration units, I'm not entirely sure. Yeah, I'll, I'll look after this after this multi, which looks like it's probably going to be dead because we're not getting any, any kind of special animations here at all. Yeah, it's gold. Unless we win this somehow. No, we're gonna tie. I'm gonna skip this. Alright. So that's dead. Actually, let's so let's go to the coin shop, actually. Because maybe... I have a feeling that you probably need to pull, like, five coins. Okay, so you need you need three. You need three dupes, in, you need three dupes of the uh, King of Fighters coins in order to trade for one of these. So... Yeah, wah wah, that's not gonna happen. Unless we pull in the next, you know, couple of multis, unless we pull all all King of Fighters units, all, all Omega Rugals, basically, because that's the only way you can actually get. Um, okay, we've got the tree branch, the red skip text, marking on the face. We haven't turned into Demon Meliodas at all. We're getting our butt kicked, so I'm gonna skip, actually. Uh, yeah. Not, not the best. Definitely not the best, and we're basically going to be using all of our, all of our diamonds on this. Which you know what? I was prepared to do. Oh, we're getting diamond, <laughs> demon Meliodas. Just as I was talking about how we haven't gotten him yet. I think that generally means. Look at that. See, we didn't even get a counter there. So we got demon Meliodas, which guarantees us an SSR, but we didn't like actually counter. So I don't know what that means. We're probably going to get the rainbow text here. So does getting Demon Meliodas mean we're... So we win. We win the battle. This is our first time we we beat this thing. Um, can we get more than one SSR here? No, we're just going to get one. And again. I don't know. There's Jericho. I like Jericho. Oh, there's Ruin. There's Ruin. Let's get that. Uh, okay. Elioni. And Jude, I wish I wish you could just skip all of the uh, the rares. Like if there was a way to do that, just because it takes it takes a while. Okay, here's the rainbow, and okay, it's 
Hey, it's gonna be Kyo. So we are getting another banner unit. It's it's Kyo, who I think is supposed to be pretty good. I think Rugal is like kind of busted from. I, again, I have no idea what I'm talking about, so I'm just parroting. So please don't take what I'm what I'm saying as as any kind of any kind of ex, like you know advice for, of somebody that knows what they're talking about. Um, I just remember reading on the Reddit. It seemed like it seemed like Rugal was pretty strong. Um, but hey, we got Kyo. That is that is pretty darn good. Um, I think at this point, should I just do singles? Because that's gonna add to the that'll add to the loyalty, right? Because I don't want to do a full multi. A full multi will actually go beyond. If I'm not mistaken. So really, what I want to do is enough of these, which would be like twenty. So yeah, I think we're just going to do singles. I know we're going to miss out on one summon, but I I don't really care. <laughs> we're going to miss out on one summon. I I, I don't care. All right, we're going to skip this because no demon. If there's a demon, then we'll we'll look we'll watch it. If there's no demon, then um yeah. If there's no demon, then we're going to skip. No demon. Skip. Seems about right. Well, I mean, overall, we actually pulled three SSRs, which isn't a bad rate. I think that's that's kind of average. We got the we got the flash. We might actually watch this one play out. We got the red skip text. We got the eye flash from the um, the monster. We're fighting back. But he has no markings, so I don't know about this one. I'm not feeling that great about it. And we got the blue text, and we got the broken sword. Thinking this is thinking this is a big L here. Unless it turns into a rainbow. Can it turn into a rainbow? No. Alright. Nope. Well it's an SR though. I'll take those tokens. Alright, so this is actually the final summon, and then we can grab our guaranteed Mai. Should we watch this one play out just because it's the last one? I guess. We may as well. Although we got more summons to go, because we're gonna have to we're gonna be summoning for Camilla as well. Yeah, in fact, you know what? Let's just let's just skip this one. I know it's not any. Oh, it's Diane! Okay. Diane's great. Okay, so loyalty, ward of claimable. Let's check our reward. And now we can choose my. So let's go ahead and just do that right now. Uh, the only one we're missing at this point is Athena, but that's fine. <laughs> I'm okay with missing out on Athena. And yay, we got Mai, a character from the King of Fighters 98 who was accidentally loaded in, into Britannia. She wishes to return to her world as soon as possible in order to participate in the King of Fighters tournament. Awesome. There we go. So let's let's wrap this up here. That is fine. And let's actually take a quick look at Mai. Yep, here she is. And she's actually in a pink outfit. So she's got a pink variant on right now. Uh, let's actually see. There's a way for me to actually take a look at her. Oh yeah, so you can rotate her here. She looks pretty awesome. Um, see, listen to her see uh, her voice lines. Pretty cool. And then let's look at her. Okay, so this is her artwork. Nice. Very nice. Back out. Hero motion. Oh, okay, cool. You can t so you can tell I, I don't play this game. I haven't I haven't toyed around with this at all. But I like how emotive the characters are. There's like a cool little like um like AR dance thing that you can do. I, I just like the interactivity that the game had in general. Um alright, so what else have we got? And then, uh, we can check out the closet, see what other outfit she has. The pink certainly isn't her... Whoops. Yeah, so this is what she's got on now. Uh, looks like these you can get from the Hawk Pass, so you'd have to buy these. Uh, looks pretty cool. Getting, uh, some, some genie vibes there. Oh, this is a cool kimono. Or, um... Oh, you know what? These are actually, um, off of the King of Fighters All-Stars. These are all outfits from King of Fighters All-Stars. So, acquired from the Sacred Treasure Shop, huh? That's her default outfit. 
Okay. All right. Well, we can we can figure it out and play around with this a little bit. Um, she got some headpieces and stuff. Yeah. All right. All right. So as I said, I'm going to go in for Camilla too here. I think that she's guaranteed after doing like a ridiculous number of multis. Yeah. Um, after you get a ton of loyalty points, but you get like a lot of these free tickets. Like I think you get 154 pulls for free just by logging in. So let's start burning through these. I've got two tickets right here. Um, I'll build up the rest and then I'll compile it all into one. But let's get started since we're already recording. Um, use one of the tickets. I think Camilla has a 0.5% rate. So actually better than all of the King of Fighters characters. Um, we're getting Hawk next to us. We have the tree branch. Nothing else going on. We're fighting back. Doesn't mean anything. <laughs> Nothing means anything. What means anything anymore? Gold text. Not feeling it. So at, at least Camilla is... Okay, we're getting our ass kicked. Uh, at least Camilla is guaranteed. Um, and we get a t again, we get a ton of tickets, which is really nice. So loyalty tickets. All right, so we're going to use another one of these. And then we're going to close things off for this segment. We'll, we'll start it back up once I get um, some more, more tickets for Camilla. And we'll spend those, and uh, if I have enough diamonds, then, you know, hopefully we actually just get her. Um, no, we're getting our ass kicked here. Okay. Yup, 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 yup. Sounds about right. We get some food. That's not bad. Alright, well, we got our target. We had to go all the way to pity for her. We ended up, total, getting two copies of Rugal. We got one copy of Kyo, and we got the pity to get our copy of Mai. Uh, and then uh, we're going to come back in here to a wonderful past to hopefully snag ourselves a copy of Guardian Deity Camilla. Fingers crossed, and we'll see how that goes. All right, so I collected all of the daily login summon tickets. We're going to spend them all right now in the hopes of getting this Camilla. It's not going to be enough to actually guarantee her in the end, but... Gives us a solid chance. I mean, we got 12 multis, so that's 12 times 11. That's pretty good, including the two, not including the two that I already spent. So let's let's get along with it. Uh, I have no idea where I'm going to fit this video in, in the grand scheme of things. The, uh, the King of Fighters collaboration video was already, like, really long. I think I'm going to skip any of these where we don't get the counter. Oh, we got the counter. Hey, nice. Okay, so I think the counter... I don't know. I don't know if I should really be venturing a guess here. There are people out there that probably know way more than me, uh, or more accurately than me about what that means, but I think that means I get a 5-star, right? Yeah, so there's the rainbow. <clears throat> so we are going to get an SR. But we tie here, so we didn't win the fight. I don't know what that means. So each of the two featured units have a 0.5% chance, I believe. If I'm not mistaken. Okay, there's gold. Ooh, hey, Elizabeth. Elizabeth and Hawk. Another gold. Now, dupe golds aren't aren't the worst thing. Um, you can you can get coins from them and exchange them for other for other units. So that that's a pretty cool feature. We are getting an awful lot of golds in this particular multi. Maybe that was what the counter was for. <laughs> okay, getting a lot of Dogato. All right. Gold he is. Let's skip that one. Another gold. Meliodas. Getting a lot of Meliodas here. All right, Hugo. Skip that. Here we go. So here's the rainbow. And oh, okay. It is one of the featured units. It's just not my target. It was Matrona, not Camilla. Matrona, I am going to actually get guaranteed because I have enough of the you know the free summons. To get her. So that's a little bit of a bummer, because again, I was already going to get her. Um, I don't know if there's like an exchange feature where if I get multiple and multiple dupes of her, that I could potentially uh, exchange them for a Camilla. And I actually don't even know if Camilla is like limited rate up or not. So if, um, if we don't get the counter, or at least the struggle back, I think I'm just going to skip the multi. Yeah, so I think I'm going to skip this one. We've got a lot of multis to go through, and I don't want this to take, like, forever. Um, oh, we did get an SSR. Whoa, we got a new SSR. Check it out. We got Helbrum. That's pretty cool. All right, well, we're getting a, an awful lot. So we're get, guaranteed an SSR on this next multi, which is very cool. And I believe the rates are 
I think, I believe the rates for Camilla and Matrona are still, like, rated up. So, uh, so that's pretty cool. I probably could have checked the rates, but oh well. So we're getting the counter. So far, the it's going a lot better than the King of Fighters pulls went at the start, at least. But that could taper off, so I'm not... Not, uh... Counting my, counting my chickens before they hatch, but we are winning this engagement, which I don't know what that means. Can we get two? Nope, we're still getting one. That's fine. It is, it's the guaranteed one, and... Alright, okay. Alright. Well... Matrona really likes me, apparently. There are, uh, there are worse things to have happen, I guess, but... That is a little bit of a bummer, like I said. Because we do get her, I think on the, I think it's on the 10th multi we get her guaranteed, if I'm not mistaken. Alright. Marmus. Skip, skip, skip. Use this one. Golgius. Right. Not many golds in this one. There are, there's less of a use for these coins, but it's all, it's still, again, I haven't summoned a ton in this game, so. Here's Vivian. Armus. You see a lot of the same faces. That's just kind of the nature of, of this game. Gil Thunder. Is this the good Gil Thunder? I don't remember. It's fine, though. Alright. Next multi. It is so awesome that we're getting so many free multis on this banner. I don't know... I feel like that's not a regular occurrence. I don't know what the basis or the reason... Okay, we're, we've lost this, so let's skip the animation. And we get nothing, of course, and that's fine. Now, of course, you can also get... Um, when, with dupes, you can also use them to level up the character. I think, like, level up their, um, their special or something. So, there are uses for dupes in this game, definitely. There's a little bit of a stutter there. I think that was actually just my phone. All right, so we're fighting back, but I think I'm still going to skip this again. We've got a lot of these to go through. And that's a lot of dupe coins. Alright. What do we got now? We got seven multis left. <laughs> Come on. Okay, we got the red skip text. No eyes flashing. It is dark. Got the mark on the face. Got a sword. Oh, uh, we're getting beaten up though. So let's skip this. And yeah. Not much going on here. Oh man. We're... <laughs> Despite the generosity, we may end up walking away with just a whole bunch of Matrona. Which is not what I was looking to do today, unfortunately. Let's skip this once again. Yeah. So we would get... Th so we're guaranteed Matrona on the next multi, as you can see right there. Could we get a Camilla alongside the Matrona? That would be really nice. I don't even think Matrona appears in the multi, I think she just appears afterwards, so we can still get like a total loss on this multi, as it looks like we're going to, because we're getting beaten up real hard. Look at that, juggled. It's alright. Okay. And there, of course, is the Matrona that we were looking to get, and then it flips to the second page of the, um, the step-up cycle, right? So again, we're not going to have enough tickets, nor are we going to have enough of the uh, diamonds to actually guarantee ourselves the Camilla, unfortunately. Um, I ended up burning, you know, just way too much on the King of Fighters banner, so it's just... I had to go to the pity for the King of Fighters banner. Alright, so we got, we're going to skip this. Yeah. Seems about right. Three left. Three left. It's not unreasonable in three to expect to get an SSR. Would be nice. Oh, are we gonna fight back? Okay, we're fighting back, at least. We got the red skip text. Let's just, let's just watch let's watch this one play out a little bit. We're on the final three multis, so. Ah, it's gold. Could still technically, I think, turn rainbow, but. I actually haven't had any fake out, and we just lost, so that's not a good sign. I'm gonna skip. <laughs> I'm gonna skip. Yeah, and that was not the best. 
All right. Down to it. We've only got two tickets left. Two multis. Two chances. Uh, actually, I could use some diamonds. I think I can do one more multi. Um, although, what I would really prefer is, again, uh, to get Camilla in these tickets. And then I could actually use the diamonds that I have, which I don't have a ton. But I could use those for Goddess Elizabeth, potentially. Because that banner is live right now. Oh man, this looks like a rough multi. I got the blue text. Are you kidding me? Yeah. Yeah, that seems about right. We're gonna skip. Ah, oh, well, you know, it's the way it goes, right? We did get some pretty good luck in getting the the matronas. We just unfortunately did not get the Camilla. We got the tree branch. Oh, we're getting beaten up. Should we should we bother watching this this travesty of a of a multi? I don't know. Maybe there are other ways to get tickets. I just did the login bonus, but there might be other... Ah. So it's just a gold text, and we're gonna tie, which means... What does it mean? Tell me, game. Three golds. Ah. Uh, Meliodas. Marmus. Hugo. Leone. God. She's awful. Ooh. Hey, Diane. Always appreciate her. Ruin and ruin. Okay, Slater. Another Hugo. And Alione. Alright. Well. That was appropriately bad. We get a guaranteed SSR on the next step, so it's going to be 30 diamonds. Let's check the rates real quick. Let's just check the rates real quick. I just want to see how far along we are. We're really far in the steps. I mean, I'd have to accumulate a lot more. I and mean, let's get some of these step up rewards, right? May as well. Okay. go. Oh, I can choose one of these? Well, let's hold off then. Can I ch hold off? Oh, no, I can't. Um, I don't know which one I want. I, I guess I'm going to go Mage Lilia. There we go. All right, and then let's, let's just check the rates real quick. So, yeah, it's 0.5%, 3% rate for an SSR. Yeah. Yeah, that's how it goes. Um, you know, we're guaranteed an SSR. We may as well spend the 30 diamonds. It gives us a chance, at the very least. Um, and I, if, the, if it's guaranteed, I don't know if... I can't remember if that means it's part of the animation or not. Could very well just mean that we get it afterwards. Uh, well, we're fighting back. For what that's worth. We got the twig. We got the rainbow text at least. Can we get two and one? It'd be really nice. I haven't gotten a two and one yet. We're getting a tie here, so probably not. And we're getting we're getting golds. So one of these is going to actually transition from a gold into a rainbow, like this one. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, it's Elizabeth and Hawk. Wow, that's a nice outfit. I've never seen this one before. That's really good. Dang, Elizabeth. Um, so not what we wanted, <laughs> not what we were looking for as far as the SSR, of course. It's a little unfortunate again. Um, I have enough to do another multi, technically. But, man, this was the guaranteed, which is what incentivized me to pull. Okay, Danafor, Kane, Twigo. I mean, I'm so far in the steps, I feel like... I feel like... Uh, so this would be what? We, I would need to get 90 diamonds by the, by the time the banner ends. That's kind of rough going. To get like the final multis is what I'm, what I'm getting at. 
So this is a this is the step over. So this is a new. Interesting. This is a new Hawk and uh, Elizabeth that I didn't have. All right. Well, you know what? Go big or go home. May as well just do it because, quite frankly, um, I don't know. I've already gone in this far, but we're getting nothing as far as anything special animation-wise. We're fighting back at least, so it's not a complete wash. We're not just getting destroyed. But we also didn't get any particular flashes or anything like that, and it's gold text. I'm pretty sure that the text is basically the last indicator. Like, if you don't have the rainbow text, I, I think you're- Oh no, we are getting a, uh, an SSR. Okay. So I was wrong. The gold text is not an indicator that, uh, it's not a, it's not a do or die. I mean, it's not basically, uh, uh it doesn't mean that you're, you're, you're doomed if you get the gold, the gold text. Okay, there's Hauser, so we have one last chance, guys. One last chance to get Camilla here. And, uh, I'm, I'm hoping. Really hoping. There's Jericho. Cute outfit. And there's Meliodas. Alright. Hey, Bon. Come on, please. Please, come on, please! Yes! Yes, we got her! Dude, that's awesome! We got her on the last multi, are you kidding me? That's crazy! That is amazing, we're getting Guardian Deity Camilla. Look at her, she looks phenomenal. Jeez Louise, okay. Whew, wow, coming in clutch. Those, I have two diamonds left. Literally two diamonds left. Um, yeah. <laughs> so that's awesome. That's actually amazing. We were able to get her in the end. There's Frisia. Jeez, wow. And I was really tempted to not go in that far, but we we did, and I'm so, so pleased that we decided to do it. All right, so here she is. Oh, doing that flip in? So sick. She looks awesome. Let's, uh, whoops. What is this? Oh, there she goes. All right, let's, uh, let's take a look at some of her outfits, actually. May as well, right? So this is her comfortable outfit. Is that what this is? And she's also got charming knit. Oh, that's very nice. Very cute. Ooh, got the warrior's armor. That looks sick. Wow. We've got the combat outfit. Looks very, very sweet as well. I mean, she looks good in everything, so... Um, so we can take a look at her. Race unknown, gender female, over 5,000 years old. Uh, birthday, August 23rd. Height, 170. Weight, 55. Blood type A. So yeah, I mean, she looks she looks really, really awesome here for sure. Ultra success. Does a little cartwheel and a flourish and a stretch. Yeah, she, she looks awesome. All right. Well, I would call that a huge, huge win. So I don't know how I'm going to upload this. Honestly, if I am going to upload it at all, I think uh, the King of Fighters pulls went so long. I, I, and I don't know if I'm just going to combine these into one or not. It's my only it's my only Seven Deadly Sins summoning video. So maybe we just make it a one big, long video and, and leave it at that. But, uh, but yeah. So let me know in the comments below if you decided to summon for Camilla... Um, or my or any of the King of Fighters characters as well. Let me know how you ended up doing on those banners. I know that the King of Fighters collaboration is gone now, and I wanted to get that video up earlier, but life happens. Hopefully you all enjoyed the video. If you did, please feel free to leave us a like, comment, and subscribe to the channel for more Seven Deadly Sins content. I don't know if any of you actually play this game or not, but let me know. Thank you so much for watching and for taking time out of your day to spend with us. We really, really appreciate it. Certainly hoping you're all staying safe, healthy, secure, and united out there, and wishing the very, very best for you, your family, and your friends. And until next time, let's keep on... drinking? Oh, that's appropriate. We're in a tavern after all. So yeah, let's keep on drinking. Bye.